This amendment has unintended consequences. The amendment could be construed by the courts to prevent the courts from enforcing private agreements between unmarried couples. It could further invalidate domestic partnership benefits currently offered to same-sex and opposite-sex couples by local municipalities, nonprofits, and other businesses. Again, the Constitution should protect rights of individuals and not limit their protections. One of the extensions of all domestic violence laws is to protect individuals who are unmarried but living together. Often this is due to federal regulations that limit needed federal benefits if a couple marries. Individuals with intellectual development disabilities who receive SSI and Medicaid are currently subjected to female federal marriage penalties. This penalty is a 25% reduction in benefits if a couple, regardless of their sex, male, female, male, male, female, female, where both are receiving SSI choose to get married. So there's a penalty. Based on the cases and decisions that have emerged from Ohio, there is a concern that our current laws would be challenged and possibly overturned if this amendment goes into our state constitution. This would possibly put a vulnerable population at risk.